What is happening guys? Welcome back to another card opening video. My name is Josh, the channel is Card Dynasty, and it is your mom's favorite YouTube channel. Today, it's hockey day, and I'm excited. We've got two boxes of Allure. Allure is a product I've watched a lot of videos on, and it is so nice I had to do it twice. I am very excited about this. Some great cards in here. The cards look amazing, and I couldn't be more stoked to open these with you today. If this is your first time in the channel, would really appreciate it if you look just a little south, hit that subscribe, maybe ring that bell, and leave me a comment. Let me know if you are into hockey and if you've opened any Allure and what you like out of this set. I definitely think uh, we need to keep this intro short and get right to the video, so let's do it. Let's open some 2019-2020 Upper Deck Allure. All right, my friends, here we are. It is time. It is time to open up some 2019-2020 Upper Deck Allure. Couldn't be more stoked. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Uh, we've got the old six cards per pack. We've got, that's tough to read, eight packs per box. Of course, we're looking for the big rookies. We're looking for the Hugheses. We're looking for Kale McCarr. Um, and there's just some great inserts and parallels in these as well, so um, I am really excited. There are a bunch of short prints as well, and Allure kind of makes it easy for you on the short prints, and I'll show you what I mean um, if we're lucky enough to get them. Oh man, I have been looking forward to this. It's kind of been sitting in my stash. What do we got here? It's been sitting in my stash, and I've been having to put it off and get to it. But here we go. Let's pull these guys out. Oh yes. All right, we're doing two hobby boxes today, not just one. Oh man, let's get into it. I am so stoked. I hope you guys enjoyed the Stanley Cup. I really enjoyed watching it this year. Congratulations to the Bolts. So here we have, we got Miko Ritanen. And you see these, these lines on the side. When it's a short print, those lines won't be there. It'll just be smooth. Um, here's the back. So here's what we're dealing with from Mr. Rico Ritanen. All right, try not to spoil anything there. So there you go, get an idea of what we're dealing with on the cards here. It's Tyler Seguin uh, with the stars. And here comes our first insert. We've got Dante Fabro, top 50. And we've got a die cut right behind that. Let's pull that off camera for a moment. So here's Dante Fabro with a top 50. Pretty cool look and insert there. Very nice. Just beautiful cards. Um, so up, coming up we have the die cut that I was just talking about. Sergei Bobrovsky. And I've said many times on the channel I am not a huge fan of die cuts but these ones I quite like. What's nice about it as well is they tell you which insert it is. So this is the red rainbow of Sergei there. So that's pretty nice. And then looks like we got a couple base cards to finish this off. We've got Phil Kessel, the Yotes, and Jake Gwensel. So we will pick up the pace just a touch since we've got a good idea of what we're dealing with here now. But yeah, I really enjoyed the Stanley Cup this year. Sports this year is just with all the craziness we're all dealing with the way the world is and COVID and everything else. It's just nice to have some sports um, to watch. So the Stanley Cup was great. Baseball playoffs have been great. NBA Finals is on now. It's, it's kind of a great time. All right, there's Matt Dumba, the Wild. We've got Joe Pavelski, the Stars again. There's Austin Matthews, top players in the league. And here we have a rookie of Rem Pitlick. 
that numbered in any way? No. And then we have another rookie. This is a rookie die cut. I believe this is the white rainbow of Guilhem Brissebois. Brissebois. Yeah, so you can see around the back there, the white rainbow. Brissebois. And there is Nikita Gusev, also a rookie, rookie base. So we'll put those aside. But hasn't it been nice just to kind of be able to take your, ooh, this pack feels thick. Uh-oh. That's what she said. <laughs> Sorry guys, had to do it. You know I do it every video. There's one every video, guys. Hey, that's pretty nice. There's a Capo Caco. Rangers, rookie, rookie base. Got us another top 50. And this one is, if I can get some focus going here, Trent Frederic, I believe it is. And here is the card that was feeling a little bit thicker. It is a jersey card. A little bit of relic there. Ben Bishop from the Stars. That's a red rainbow jersey, Mr. Bishop. Kind of a plain piece there, no patch. But I am a huge fan of relic cards in general. You know, we love our autos too, but. So there's our top 50 and there's our Capo Caco. And then we have another uh, Ben Bishop, just the base. I just, uh, I really like relic cards. I really like memorabilia cards because when I was a kid I would have lost my mind when I was collecting as a kid if I would have gotten something like that. Could you imagine getting a piece of jersey or bat or a stick something like that and they just didn't exist um, at the time so uh, there's Cloud, Cloud Guru the great Connor McDavid another one of the top players in the league. Let's flip this guy around here. We got Jack Hughes. Fantastic rookie card of Jack Hughes. I love it. And then a rookie white rainbow of Nick Suzuki with the Canadiens. That's another really nice one. There's Cam Atkinson. And another Jack Hughes. Oh my goodness. So this is the Jack Hughes short print, as you can see on the side here, no lines. And then this is the Jack Hughes rookie card base. Outstanding, two Hughes in the same pack, and one of them is a short print. Golly, I love this stuff, love it. All right, there's Kirby Dak, rookie. Here's a top 50 of Ryan Kuffner. And then we have another bit of mem there. Blake Lazotte, rookie card. There's Max Jones, rookie card. Ducks. And then Rasmus Sandin, that's a good one. I don't know if Max is still I don't know if he stayed up, but there's uh, Rasmus Sandin um, as well. Uh, we're hitting some pretty good stuff so far. God, this product is just so good. These boxes will run you about 100 bucks. Is that right? I believe I just misspoke. I think it was 75 or 85. I'm having a hard time now remembering. Um, but there's not a lot left uh, when I was on DA Card World. Uh, Kale Fleury, we got Philippe Zadina, and here we go with an iced out Sebastian Ajo. Don't believe these are numbered in any way, no, just a pretty cool insert, love that background there. Look at that, it's beautiful, beautiful blue. We got Brad Marchand, and that is the white rainbow once again, and then <clears throat> We have Zach Sinitian, I believe it is, another rookie, and then Mark Giordano. So, so far, I am quite happy with this one, with this first box. We've got two packs left in this one. 
gotten some really nice things. Still looking for something real big though, of course. There's Trent Frederic again. Here comes a top 50 of Alexandre Teixeira. And then we have uh, Alex Ovechkin in the white rainbow. Wonderful. Max Domi. There's Anders Lee. And then Nico Sturm, rookie with the Wild. Doing quite nicely with the rookies. Last pack in this first box, guys. There's the great keeper, Mark Andre Fleury. There's Matthew Chuchuk. Chuchuk, I believe. Oh, let's flip this guy here. And for the record, Austin Matthews insert. Let's see what we got on the back there. No numbering. Okay. I think we got a good one here. And we did. Beautiful. There is Philip Zadina, rookie patch auto. Well, rookie jersey auto, anyway. Pretty standard piece of jersey there. Um, Unfortunately, they are sticker autos, but we got that one pretty nicely done. Didn't come off at all. God, that's beautiful. That is great. And this is the Blue Line Auto Jersey. You see right up there, Blue Line Auto Jersey. My focus is having a hard time, I apologize. And this is numbered 76 out of 99. Amazing. Love it. All right, guys, that is box one. We did it. And we will, we gradually picked up the pace on that one a little bit, I think. Don't hold me to that. I might have been going slow still because I just enjoy these so much. But we will definitely try to go a little quicker on these. But we're doing so well so far. Oh, man. Hope that can continue. All right, let's get into it. One thing I really appreciate about hockey cards is the uh, is the memorabilia and relic cards are so unique. These ones were, were you know were kind of basic, but there are some others that are just incredible. Um, so there is Artemi Panarin, I believe. Uh, Oliver Ekman Larson there. There's another uh, Tashir, that's his rookie. So we got his, uh, got an insert of him earlier. There's Zach McEwen, the Canucks. Rookie short print, as you can see there. Here comes the white rainbow of Zach Sinitian. And then Carey Price. If the uh, last box was any indicator we might have um, something in this one might have a hit so there's pk Subban, johnny goudreau here comes a top 50 of libor hajik is it hajik oh very nice patrick kane the greens are numbered i believe and yes that is correct numbered 41 out of 99 the green quartz of Patrick Kane with the Hawks. And then we have, right after that, a nice rookie of Taro Hirose. And then Jordan Bennington with the Blues. Some very nice green quartz. Insert there, numbered 99. I was surprised to find somewhat that this is also a retail product. And I found some of that retail product on a road trip where I was passing through Alabama. I'll tell the whole story when I when I do some of that unboxing, but uh, it was pretty pretty cool. Here's Nico Hirscher. There's Barrett Hayton, rookie card. Here's an open ice of Steven Stamkos, which of course spoils the card behind it. But this is what the open ice look like. They just have this piece in the middle where you can see kind of right through it. So there's the great Stamkos. Open ice. Here we have 
uh, Oliver Wallstrom, rookie in the white rainbow. There's Alex Took, the Golden Knights. And then another Stamkos. We got the Stamkos base and we got the Stamkos open ice in the same pack. I think that's the second pack where we've had the same player twice, one in a, a insert or variation and then getting the base. That's kind of cool. Looks like we got something thick on that one. <laughs> Alexander Ovechkin. There's Philippe Myers, top 50. And here comes Oliver Wallstrom. So we have a rookie red with a little bit of the, the jersey there. And then behind him is Sebastian Ajo. And then finally, Thomas Hurdle. Yeah, I'd like to get a nice chunky patch out of this. I don't know, um, I don't know exactly what some of the higher end relic inserts look like, but hopefully there's something available, and hopefully we get it. All right, so there is uh, Jakob Vrana. I think it's Jakob. And there we go, Kale McCarr, outstanding. Got an iced out of Claude Giro. And here comes a white rainbow, rookie of Max Jones. Blake Lazat, base rookie. Got his relic a little bit earlier. And then finally, Eric Carlson, base. Kale McCarr, bam! That is what I'm talking about. So then we've got a couple of Jack Hughes. We've gotten a Kale McCarr. Um, I think Quinn Hughes is in here somewhere. Hopefully we can find him. And uh, Kubalik, I believe he's in here as well. I'd like to find him. I've got his young guns. You can see uh, I pulled his young guns when I opened um, Upper Deck Series 1, and I'll link that video just above so you can check that out. There's Matthew Barzal, uh, Mark Shifley. Here comes something, the top 50 of Adam Fox. Very nice. That's a rookie card. I have his young guns as well, pulled in that same video. There's Kirby Dak in the white rainbow rookie. Uh, Sergei Bobrovsky again. And Andre Valasilevsky. So that was a nice pack for sure. Beautifully done. Love it. Oh. This one. I opened this one like I opened it with a chainsaw. Sweet mother of mercy. Goodness gracious, boys. All right. Connor Helbjuk. Helbjuk. Brad Marchand. Here comes a winter storm warning of Dylan Larkin. I don't know. No, those are just, that's just an insert. Um, oh, 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 oh. Almost spoiled it, but there we go. We've got another auto of Rem Pitlick. I am not familiar with his work, but it's a top 50 of Rem Pitlick. And there is the congratulations on the back. That's outstanding. Got us another auto. Still got two cards left in that pack, and I said his name, and here he is, Mr. Quinn Hughes. Saw his brother earlier, and then John Carlson. Guys, last pack. This is it, and this has been just nothing short of outstanding. Just great cards. They look amazing. Ah, last pack magic. Let's finish this off with something great. Uh, there's Mitch Marner. We've got a Carson Kuhlman, uh, top 50. That's the top 50 rookies. I have his um, Young Guns, uh, I think I have his Young Guns canvas in fact. And there's Nico Hirscher in the red, which is the red rainbow, not number. We have Brock uh, Bozer. Bozer, Zach McEwen, and finally Cody Glass. All right, guys, that was tremendous. Let's flip it around for a quick recap. Well, guys, there we have it. 
I can't be happier. Um, that was that was just tremendous. Allure 2019 20. If you can still get your hands on it and you're into hockey cards, you have got to have this set. It is so much fun to open. The cards are amazing. We got them all, guys. We got Kale McCarr. We got Jack Hughes. We got Quinn Hughes. We've got some great um, autographs. We got some numbered cards. Just a just an outstanding product. I can't recommend it enough. Um, I'll, I'll be excited to compare what we did here to the retail product that I was mentioning a little bit earlier. But um, this gets all the thumbs up, not just from me, but from your mom. She loves this product as well, and don't let her down. Go get some and, and really enjoy it. It really is fantastic. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for being with me today, and I will see you guys on the next video.